Today we're going to address exercising utilizing the double cord resistance band. These exercises for both strengthening movement and muscle. The following six exercises are built around the rubber exercise cables or bands. The sequence of exercises to assist the athlete or general population client in the development of strength, coordination, and stability. The movement is in a multiple direction and multiple, plane, multiple planes. The intent is to train and strengthen movement, not just muscles. The exercises are as follows. Two arm chest pressed while stepping into a forward lunge. Alternate lead legs with each rep. This develops balance and coordination, strengthens core, chest, shoulders, tricep, glutes, and quads. The next exercise is a two arm chest row with a squat. This also develops balance, strengthens core, back, glutes, and overall leg development. Two, three, four, and stop. The more complex movements will be the one arm chest press with an alternate leg forward lunge, right arm, left leg, and then you will reverse. Work one side then the other. This is a complex movement by adding the one arm and alternating with the, one, the other leg. This is a challenge for both core and balance while working the same muscles as a chest press exercise. We have taken basic push or pull movements and made them more advanced and complex by adding additional movements such as lunges or squats. The next exercise is chest row an alternate leg backward lunge, that would be the right arm and left leg, leg in reverse, is also a more complex movement. It greatly challenges the core and balance while also working the back and legs. The next exercise is a rotational movement with band and body in line. The right arm will be extended laterally, grasping the handle of the cable. The body and the cable should form a straight line. The left hand or away hand will be then placed over the right hand. Drop the hips slightly to maintain an athletic position. Head should be turned and looking in line with the right arm and the band. You will then rotate to the left or opposite direction while keeping the arm straight. Then while under control, rotate back to the starting position. Once again, this is a very complex movement, very challenging for the core and the balance. It's an excellent exercise for the oblique muscles and transverse abdominus muscles, which are very difficult muscles to exercise. Three, four, five. The last exercise we're going to address is a swim. It's performed facing the anchor post, standing in an athletic position, arms extended proximally shoulder height. Drive the arms down and back towards the body. Keep the elbows firm but not locked. Bend the upper body down slightly performing an ab crunch simultaneously with the arm movement. This strengthens the abs, rear delts, tricep, and upper backs. You should use the strongest cables possible but always one in which the movement can be performed correctly and safely. You will attach the end of the cable securely to a post to ensure the safety of the training. Throughout. To increase the difficulty and to provide greater challenges, you can increase the number of sets and reps. You can also utilize a stronger cable. In future videos, we will be addressing vertical and horizontal jump development and testing for volleyball, basketball players, and for just athletes who want to develop overall explosiveness. These exercises are being demonstrated by Blake Owens, a senior in high school, a legacy Christian, Frisco, Texas. Blake is a football running back, a sprinter in track, and a bodybuilder. He will be attending the U.S. Military Academy at West Point next year.